The floodlights are shining down on the players here at the Estadio Mestalla. I'm Derek Ray, joined in the commentary position by Lee Dixon. And we've got so much to look forward to. This is where it all begins in Europe's Premier Club competition, the UEFA Champions League, the group stage, match day one action. It's Valencia facing Atalanta. Well, the first group stage of the Champions League is always exciting. Three points is vital for both teams to get off to a good start. Or a draw may be a good result as well. We're about to find out what happens. Mukhtar Diakabe plays alongside Gabriel Paulista in the centre of defence. Danny Parejo starts alongside Jeffrey Condompia in central midfield. And up front, Kevin Gamero plays with Rodrigo in attack. And really in this great competition, there's been continuity since season 2003-2004. The same format. Remember, there used to be a second group stage once upon a time, Lee? Well, they did, and simply it didn't work. I think the, uh, the, the format now is certainly a lot better. It's a bit more exciting, a bit earlier in the competition. It seemed to drag on a bit that second phase, didn't it? We're well, starting 11 for Atalanta. And you tend to know what you're going to get tactically from this team. High pressing. Well, high pressing, high energy. I played this system at Arsenal many years under George Graham. It doesn't half work when it works well. Sometimes you can just get exposed to the back, but they've got it down to a tee, to be fair. Here's Gameiro. Vas. Gameiro. And Dombia with it. Come, Dombia! Terrific reflex action. Yeah, you've just got to come out and spread yourself and hope for the best. And short it is. Cutting the ball back. Well, body in the way. Well, he was being very closely marked, but the header not on the target. No, just off target, and the thing is, the defender did his job, and he just couldn't quite get enough of his head on it. Parejo. Good numerical situation. Cross fired over. Quite simply, not clinical enough with the header lead. Well, headers are always difficult. It's all about timing, and he got the timing completely wrong there. Torres they've given it away Mario Pasalic Martin Deron Ilicic playing with purpose and control Remo Freuler terrific block there Gameiro perfectly set up for the counter-attack, you know. Whatever it takes to keep them out. Freyla in possession. Martin Deron. 
Mario Pasenic. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. But he has clear options in the middle. Back from the byline. Can they put it away? And no nonsense defensive clearance. It's with Carlos Soler. Well, great read there to intercept. Running with the ball confidently. It's with Toloi. Ilicic. It might be on for them. Has a go. Off the post and back in play. Visualisation and execution. The offside flag had to go up, and it did. Yeah, look along the line, look along the line. It's with Gaia now. Mukhtar Diakabi. Vas. Diakabi. And Torres on the ball. Oh, a nice looking pass. Well, there is a very alert goalkeeper for you. And Torres on the ball. Vas giving them the gift of possession. It looks promising. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Gaia. And we're tackling like that. The onus is on the referee to take action, potentially. And following that tackle, he's got to go into the book. Yeah, he's missed time more than anything there. Just mistimed his tackle. Torres Cavejo tremendous block and he did what he had to do defensively Parejo and Torres on the ball Vass space and time for the cross and it crossed the touchline so a throw in here Parejo! And that shot from seemingly miles out, close. Well, he got too much space and he thought, why not? Why not shoot from here? Now Parejo. He might be able to profit from the wide position. And teammates to play it to. Well, sometimes you can't argue with top-notch defending. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. Gamero. And the shot decidedly lacking accuracy. Well, he had other options as well, but he chose to shoot. Well, there you have it, right on cue with the stats. And it tells you everything you need to know about the team today. They've been so poor in front of goal, wasteful, and the manager is furious. I know what they'll be doing next week, shooting practice day after day. Throw-ins given. Possession lost. with Toloi it's with Daron Mario Pasalic Gozens promising sequence a 
think everyone knew that was foul play and the referee left with little choice but to award the free kick that could well be his final warning he's got to tread well he couldn't quite keep the header down well it was the pace on the cross sometimes with that much power on the cross just cushion it otherwise it goes over Diakabi Daniel Vaz and Torres on the ball Gameiro and slipped through beautifully just couldn't capitalise there and the referee is going to add on three minutes now he must favour the cross Kondogbia the opening goal due reward for their efforts well they've made the pressure count they really deserve this lead let's have a look at that again the keeper thinks he's done enough but he hasn't he's just gone past him he does get a touch on it though let's have another view of that goal the game then and with that the first half draws to a close you've certainly got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point Lee well his manager will be delighted with him He's been spot on in this game, hasn't he? Energy, imagination, desire, and a steely determination. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. control of the ball here crossing possibilities fruitful looking attack and he cuts inside the ball with Kondogbia they don't normally need a second invitation to give it a go on the counter teammates could potentially join in clattered away Gabriel Gaia losing possession a bit easily dangerous looking attack Ilicic Martin Deron Remo Freuler Gozens strong play here on the shielding front Freuler in possession Hans Hatterboer. Patient build up at the moment. Martin Deron. And that was a very fine read. And they'll have to throw it back in play. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready. And now they will make the personnel change. On and on he goes. Options in the centre. That's a very impressive piece of defending. That is how to apply the pressure. Read it magnificently and intercepted. It's with Zapata. Can't miss, surely! It wasn't far away from the target, Lee. No, it was decent. Really, really decent chance for the lad. They'll keep pushing away to try and get that equaliser.
Not what he was intending. Bad pass. Extremely sloppy in possession. Untidy in possession. And threading it forward. Must score! Well, a moment he would dearly love to have back. Well, listen, he's tried to hit it too hard. Just relax a little bit, focus on your technique. They'll get ready for the throw-in. So a throw-in here. Poor pass under no real pressure. Good use of advantage by the referee. And options in the centre. Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. Pondopia. And on the ball, Gaia. Rodrigo. And showing fine vision. Will he find the net? He's got the right idea with that pass. And it's gone in. Just what the doctor ordered. Things looking very bright for them now with this buffer. Well, the coaches will tell you, pass the ball how you would like to receive it. Perfectly weighted, and he finished it off brilliantly. A chance to revisit the goal. Substitution time it is. Well, a second goal for them here. Fifteen minutes remaining. Hans Hattebor. And plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. Cleared away comprehensively. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Real chance. Gamero. Gamero! The goals keep going in for them. I don't think they're going to throw this away now. Absolutely omnipotent. Well, let's just look at this again. Just when you think you've got a team by the scruff of the net, they break on you like that. What pace, what brilliance. Just look at the movement. It's a brilliant, brilliant goal. And a substitution in the offing. Now we're underway again, and this game was finished as a contest a long time ago. Malinowski in possession at Tabor. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Ilicic. The chance might be on for him. Can he make it count? A possession lost, intercepted. And he takes on the shot. Absolutely magnificent goalkeeping. Oh, he's almost turning away. He thinks he scored. The goalkeeper doesn't. And he's fired over the corner. Not the result from the set piece they were looking for. Wonderful block. It's one corner after another. So 
the corner, played into the box. Not really the ideal clearance. And on the volley, that's not exactly how he intended to catch it. Well, it's worth a chance. One in ten, it goes in the top corner. Nine out of ten, goes where it did do. Oh, he's given the ball away. He's had to go for it. Wins the ball. The ball with Kondogbia. A chance maybe from the wide position. Is it going to be? Well, it's a procession of goals. And surely there's no way they can let this slip now. Absolutely dominant. Well, it's a lovely goal. The pass was sublime, but then the finish. Not easy sometimes when you have so much time to think about it. Well, let's go back to the goal that was scored. there were any lingering doubts about the outcome surely they now have been removed the referee's verdict is three additional minutes one minute remaining what a shocking pass really might be able to get in behind the defence Gomez and that's it for tonight full time and an encouraging start for them three points from their initial fixture lead yeah really really strong start that's what you need but with five games to go very important you stay in the now one game at a time Derek bit of a cliche well this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance this evening Lee well, clearly the difference between the two sides today. Two goals, a really good performance, ran into the channel, did everything right. Absolutely, 9 out of 10.